Welcome to the Book Nook, story time for kids. Today we're reading You Can't Let an Elephant Drive a Digger by Patricia Cleveland Peck. You can't let an elephant drive a digger. Diggers are big, but elephants bigger. If you want to shift mud and dig big holes, best not let an elephant near the controls. Don't let a polar bear cut your hair. Unless, that is, you want people to stare. She'll paw you and claw you and grab your hair tight, then snippity-snip. Oh, dear, what a fright. Never be woken by a slithery snake. He won't just give you a gentle shake. He'll coil all around you. And that's not funny. You could even end up as a bump in his tummy. Don't join a gorilla for a scooter ride. You'll wobble and slip and swivel and slide. But he'll just beat his chest and go faster. Be warned, this scoot could end in disaster. To let a shark bath you is a silly idea. The sight of her jaws will fill you with fear. And if she should offer to wash your back, jump out, quick, she's about to attack. Never let a seal prepare you a meal, especially breakfast. You'll get a raw deal. Of course, there's nothing wrong with fish. But who wants a whole school on their dish? And don't go to the loo with a kangaroo. She won't be helpful, believe me, it's true. She'll bounce off the toilet and wee on the floor. No, push her outside and quick, shut the door. Nor should an octopus help you get dressed. She'll have fun, but you won't look your best. With socks on your hands and pants for a hat, you won't want to go out looking like that. Never brush your teeth with a crocodile. If he offers to help you, just run a mile. He'll bite your toothbrush and break it in two. And if he gets hungry, his snack could be you. Don't let a wolf read your bedtime story. He'll choose a tale both gruesome and gory, and his eerie howling will drive you mad. No, better leave story time to your dad. Never, never, ever share a skunk's bunk. He'll feast at midnight on grubs, worms, and junk. Then, from his bottom, he'll let out a stink so vile and so nasty you won't sleep a wink. But what can we do? the animals cry. We just want to help, but you won't let us try. Well, here's an idea. What do you say? Forget about helping. Let's just go and play. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe for more great stories.